Yo, what's going on guys? So we're back for some more Battlegrounds content. And so here you can see I match Bureau Man for the very first time. He has 213 ranked matches. I only have 71 at this time, which like I thought I thought I was on the grind, right? And then I matched Bureau Man and I was like, wow. It puts me to shame with those amount of matches played. Like, holy fudge. Like, okay. Um, but I was excited because um I when Battlegrounds first came out, I saw Bureau Man was up behind the leaderboard, so I was very excited to play him. And also, I've known from his YouTube channel that he's, he's quite skilled, so I was expecting a really good matchup here. Uh, so I banned his, uh, his Professor X, of course. There's no way I'm going to give this guy his rank for Professor X. Uh, and then Mephisto Killmonger, two annoying defenders that I don't have in my deck, so I went for the ban on them. And he bans my Kitty, Torch, and Nick Fury. Okay. So up first we draft a CGR and Thing. CGR has just been um, phenomenal in Battlegrounds. He's so good for it. Um, one of the reasons why I want to rank for him, and I think he will be my Cosmic rank four because he was just so good in here. You guys are going to see him putting some work. I see Beer Man also picked up his own Cosmic Ghost Rider. And I went for a reroll there because I'm playing Biro Man. Like I gotta, I gotta get the best drafts possible if I want to have a chance at beating this guy, you know, I'm expecting a really, really strong opponent. So, um, I got Weapon X and Doom, which is great. Here, I pick up Penny and I bomb. And I'm like, okay, like, <laughs> this is pretty good. I'm, I'm drafting really hot right now. This is a really good deck. I got some good attackers. I got some of the best defenders in the entire game on my team right now. Like, okay, like, we're, we're good. And then also pick up a Megs. I'm going to go for because the Magic's 5-star, Greg Man's rank 2, is not that good of a defender, I don't think. It depends. Uh, and Megs is just a beast. Uh, Megs is awesome. Megs is also really good in Battlegrounds. Kind of want to rank for him, but I think my next mutant rank 4 is going to be Domino or Weapon X. Um, for Battlegrounds, just for defense and for war defense. So, yeah, so he places Domino on defense first, and I'm going to go ahead and place Doctor Doom because I think Doctor Doom is <clears throat> one of the absolute best defenders in the entire game for sure, especially with Mystic Dispersion level five. Um, it is ridiculous how good of a defender Doom is. If they don't have like a torch or an eye bomb, um, even still, like things can go wrong in those matchups. But um. Doom is just uh, such a monster. So I, I go for Penny Parker on offense here. So I don't think I've ever used Penny offensively, but he picked his Domino and I'm like, he's tech. So uh, I go for, and <laughs> my first match is Bureau Man. My, I get the glitch, which is the Wi-Fi symbol on the bottom right. I'm like, dude, you gotta be kidding me. Really? Not against Bureau Man. Come on, dude. So I quickly, the quick, the, the way that I found to negate that bug is just quickly restart your game like what i'm doing right here i'm gonna by the time i get into the fight the time is gonna be at about a minute 45 which so i lose about 15 seconds yeah minute 43 so i lost about 17 seconds due to connection issues so if i end up losing this because of that i was gonna be really really pissed off man you know like come on don't not against Bureau, man so um we get started. I really don't know what I'm doing with Penny. I'm I'm basically just comboing. Like I really don't know how to play her offensively. Um, I know how to fight. I'm pretty damn good at fighting her now because uh, I've got so much practice uh, in battlegrounds. But fighting with her, yeah, I don't know. Right there, uh, we got an auto block, which is really nice. But here we catch a bit of a combo. So already I'm I'm playing bad, losing some health. I uh, go for a little light intercept there. Does not work out. Run into her heavy. Catch another combo. I'm like, dude. All right, you know, whatever. Like this, this round is lost. I was, we started with connection issues. Like, ugh, this is just doomed, doomed from the start. Um, but I'm gonna try to finish the fight because you never know. I mean, Doom is my defender, so you gotta keep that in mind. Um, so yeah, just pushing the Domino to special twos, baiting them out, hoping that she doesn't get lucky. Because if she gets lucky, and there's evasion. The evasion is just prolongs the fight or I can just get hit again. Here go for special one, power burn, we're running out of time. This fight is just he's not going well at all. Um I really wasn't feeling penny offensively, uh, especially after this fight, but it was totally my own scrubness uh holding me back here. But yeah, we go for one kind of combo, we kill like 10 seconds left. But it's enough! 
<laughs> Dr. Noom, the goat, such a goaded defender, man. Um, <laughs> rank 5 Mystic Dispersion, Dr. Doom, 6 star. This is why I want to rank 4 Doom, guys, because he's such a menace in Battlegrounds on defense. Like, it's, it's ridiculous how good he is. So, I totally did not deserve to win that first round, but we did, so I was like, you know, I'll take it at the end of the day. I'm like, alright, who am I going to throw on defense now? I'm like, alright, let's hit him with the Weapon X. Hit him with the Weapon X, he's probably going to go Megs, I was assuming. Um, but still, things can go wrong. Uh, and he's going to go for, I'm, I'm thinking, I'm guessing Petty Park. Like, the best defender he has, and he does go for Petty Park. I'm like, alright, go uh, Cosmic Ghost Rider. I've done, I fought her quite a few times with Cosmos Ghost Rider, I've gotten better. I think uh, in the match versus KT, we had a pretty poor performance, but um, here I play a bit better. And he also goes for Cosmic Ghost Rider, so that's uh, a bit of a Cosmic Ghost Rider off. I think his penny might be 6 star rank 2 though, uh, the PI does seem a bit low, I think that is a rank 2. Um, even though she is undue, but I think my penny was like 9,000 rating or something. A bit higher. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and start with a heavy attack. And the name of the game here is to try not to dex. And that's, uh, the AI kind of has to play around with you the right way. Um, so here, throw my special two. And she auto blocks it. And I'm just like, dude, are you serious? But uh, luckily, we, we got the precision off at least. But, you know, not the best start. So here, push to special two, and I just want her to throw it, um, and I don't I don't want to dex. So here, boom, she throws it. Perfect. Didn't have to dex, but I run into it. Uh, but then we hit a pretty clean intercept. Over five combo. Uh, drop the special two. It hits super hard, and then here, I'm just looking for a heavy attack. Right there, she gets away from it. But here, one more. Boom. You drop her. Minute-long fight. You know, there was 90% feeling pretty good. Uh, he's still fighting the Weapon X. So I was like, there's a chance. There's a chance uh, if he doesn't come out within like the next 10 seconds. And then unless he has like full health. I think we got this round. Uh, it was a much better fight than, uh, much, I'm, like I said, I'm much better at fighting Penny than I am at, than using her. Um, but yeah, we still messed up a bit with getting the special two auto block, but managed to pull out a decent fight um and yeah this fight should be coming to an end in a second here let's see i think does he does he time out or does he die oh yeah look at that man i'm not sure what, i'm really not even sure what happened uh i think mag probably would have been the better play but yeah, so first ever time playing Bureau Man, we managed to, to win somehow. That first round was uh, pretty lucky. But uh, yeah, um, and then next match, boom, match him again. <laughs> so like, all right, I'm okay with that. Like, I was like, all right, I feel like I kind of got lucky the first time. You know, let's have a rematch. Let's see. Let's, let's run it back. Let's run it back. So I'm going to stick with the same bands. Get that Professor X out of here. Uh, Bands Killmonger and Mephisto, because again, they're not in my deck, and I don't really want to fight either of them. Um, Killmonger started to scare me a little bit towards the end of the beta. I don't, I don't know why. Uh, if I have CGR, I would be fine. Uh, I don't even think I ever had to really fight a Killmonger, but just the thought of it <laughs> kind of spooked me. Um, so here I draft Penny and CGR, which is great. You know, they were, uh, well... Penny's such a good defender, you guys saw. CGR was great on attack in the last round. So here, see my kitty pride. Do I go for her here? I actually don't remember. I think this is, the reroll is kind of tempting here. But I go for Shang-Chi and Kitty. I, I didn't really use Shang-Chi like much at all. And, but I, I feel like he does have potential in Battlegrounds. Um, but he's still lacking Defensively, you know, he's def it's nice when a champ, you, know, you pick them, like Kitty Pride, for example, she's really great offensively, but you know, if you gotta put her on defense, she's good on defense too, so it's, it's nice to just have a champ like that, but Shang-Chi, sometimes you get down to like your last couple champs, things don't go the way you expect, and you just don't have a defender, and like, you never want to play Shang-Chi on defense, you know? <laughs> uh, but I managed to pick up my Warlock and my Magneto, and I'm feeling... 
great. I'm feeling really good with my drafts. And then here, do I go for a reroll here? Yeah, that was a terrible reroll. <laughs> I think I end up picking a uh, Hit Monkey for for Blizzard because I, I heard good things about Hit Monkey. I don't think I had used him at this point. Um, maybe this was even before I heard good things. I'm not sure, but I picked him just because didn't really have good other options. Felt like so he's gonna place Maw on defense first. So you know I don't have my torch or anything. I don't have uh, any science champion. So I'm like, who am I gonna fight that Maw with? Who am I placing on defense? Let's go for Penny. And against this Maw, Kitty, I guess he goes for White Mags against Penny. Which is interesting. And um, we're gonna go for Kitty Pride against Ebony Maw. Feel like rank four Kitty. You know, I just and just Kitty in general. I feel really good with her. I've been I practiced with her for a few months. I don't even know how long, but for months. I just, I played her a lot. And I used her a lot in 7.4 as well. And it's just, she's bad. She's so broken. But I I feel like I've gotten to a really good skill level with her. Like a good mastery of her as a champion. So I feel pretty confident going into just about any matchup with her that doesn't have like, cowardice. I would not feel confident going into a match like that. So here, just going to heavy punish Ebony Ma's special one. It's the easiest way I find to knock him down. And uh, yeah, here we're just going for combos. If he throws his special two, that's fine. I'm just going to run into it like that. One of the scary things about Ebony Ma. Um, and here I accidentally get hit, man. Oh, that's so unfortunate. If I could have just dashed in there, dropped this, uh, I would have saved so much health. But a falter again here. I miss my heavy, and oh, things are going so downhill at this point. They were going so well uh, at the start of the fight. Uh, right there, he missed, so I decided to just throw my special. I don't want to lose prowess. Just let come out of there. Pretty quick fight, 54 seconds. Unfortunately, we did take a lot of damage though. So this one is it's probably going to be going to be pretty tight. It's going to be pretty close. <clears throat> Depends really how much health he comes out of there with. Um, this one, I. Thought I was gonna lose, man. It was, it's so. It always happens to me. Like I, I, I play so perfect for like the first half of a fight. I'm feeling great. Time's going by great, and then I just make some stupid little mistake and lose health, and then I, I end up losing because of it. That's happened to me so many times, and it's so infuriating when that specifically happens. Uh, but as you guys can see, his fight is is taking a little while. So I was like, okay. By this point, you know, even if he comes out of there with full health, I think we got him um and yeah he, he came out of there healthy 85 percent but you know kitty's fast so we ended up with 48,000 points he had just under 45 pretty close round that's what it comes down to health versus speed um it's all part of the mode it's very makes it interesting with these matchups um as far as the scoring system goes i, I like this one a lot more than the uh when we have in the ccp beta much much more but i still think there could be some improvements so here i really wasn't sure who to throw in defense i kind of wanted to throw warlock but he has that cgr who would probably just melt through him um so i, I didn't opt for that i also wanted to save warlock for his domino if he ended up using her on defense which he did so like all right i'm gonna go warlock versus domino um and i i and i'm assuming he's probably gonna go ghost i was I'm like all right like his fight is probably gonna be pretty fast but so is mine and he's is a five star domino whereas my defender hit monkey was a six star um plus we also have class advantage so i'm like all right as long as i play like perfect or near perfect i think i should close this round out and i should win so um, i was feeling pretty confident going in uh to this matchup so just trying to get some uh, some parries off so we can get Domino uh, infected. There we go. Now we don't have to worry about masochism or any kind of healing like that. Uh, we'll be we we'll good to go. We can you know, willpower, any anything like that. And instead, we'll, we'll start DJing if she's healing or anything. So yeah, at this point, my warlock was still just Sig 20. Now he's Big Daddy rank four. So that degen damage is also going to be quite useful, I think, in battlegrounds um, on champions that have the uh, non-contact attacks uh, because it's really going to add up. Um, it's like a thousand damage now versus here. It's looking like 400-ish. 
So more than more than double. Which is amazing. And here you can see we're we're playing pretty clean. Uh minute long fight. Came out here with 80%. I'm like, alright, that should be a wrap. Psych! He destroyed Hitmonkey in 36 seconds. I was like, it's like crap, crap, crap. But that that's not good. I really thought I had it, so I you know, I didn't really think about my drafts for the next round. I'm like, oh, am I screwed now? And so I'm looking at his champs. I'm like, okay, CGR, Stealth, Spidey, Joe Fixit. There's only one character there that's not metal. And that's Joe Fixit. So I was like, okay, Magneto on defense. This is, this is the, Magneto's a dark horse for defense, man. If you can get your opponent off guard and use up their non-metal drafts, put them into a position like this now he has to use joe fix it against my magneto and i have cgr versus stealth spider-man so definitely feel like a bit more of a if i had to pick which one of these fights i wanted to do i would definitely pick this one i, I have no experience with joe fix it uh so if, even if i did i'm pretty sure i'd still rather choose this fight uh this seems definitely a lot more favorable so uh get his evade out of the way and now I'm trying to build up to my special two. I get that off, and again, I want to try and not deck. So here, just throw my heavy. It doesn't matter that it didn't connect. Just wanted to get that off. So we can do and go ahead and get the damnation. Uh, we time it with masochism, so it's just one of my armor breaks that gets shrugged off. You don't want it to eat the damnation instead. That's unfortunate when that happens. Uh, here it goes, special one. Again, I'm going to try to bait out the evade. Right there, he got some decks on me. Um, things are slowing down a bit, but you know, I, I feel like I got time, so I'm just trying to not mess up, take my time a little bit here. Uh, getting close to another special two, I don't think I've dexed yet, so go ahead, drop this, and it does some pretty solid damage. Uh, I just need like one more combo, I think. I'm gonna bait a heavy or something, yeah, just hit a parry, one more combo gets him down. And that, again, another about a minute fight, come out of there with 80% feeling. Pretty good about this one, man. If he somehow manages to take this mags down uh, faster than me, I I don't know. I really thought I had him here, and we did end up having him. Um, I was actually impressed and surprised that he took mags down with that Joe fix it. So yeah, we ended up taking a third round off beer man here. Very very good matches. Uh, I just I think I outplayed him a little bit just in the drafts, you know, making him. Um, Saving my Magneto like that. That's why I think Magneto is so good in a battlegrounds uh, for situations like that. But also, he's just so good against male champs, you know? Uh, so, it's... Magneto's great, man. It's really great. I was honestly considering rank warring him because of, because of that. I've had many situations like that where I, where I used him in that way uh, to, to win rounds at the end. Uh, but yeah, guys, that's going to do it for this battlegrounds video. This is really it for the stuff I have recorded from this last beta. Um, it was really fun though, especially playing Bureau Man and KT1, two very skilled individuals, and look forward to playing them when the mode's actually real and actually matters and stuff, uh, when, with stakes on the line. Uh, but yeah, if you guys did enjoy, I would really appreciate you dropping a thumbs up, subscribe if you want to see more Battlegrounds content. I'm going to be going so hard on these when they come out, guys. Road to 100,000 subscribers, hopefully this summer. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out.